SOLIDWORKS 2023 adds several new additions for the administration of SOLIDWORKS. Adding serial numbers to the license manager can now be done directly on the activation window with the new add button. The serial numbers may also be deleted as long as they are not activated. This new addition makes it very convenient to manage your serial numbers. If you use network licensing for your flow simulation and you have the additional add-ins for HVAC and electronics cooling, it is now possible to launch flow simulation without tying up the licenses for these products. The setting is controlled on the license order tab of the license manager. Turning the setting off and going to the add-ins tab of the command manager allows the user to select which products need to be added in. This option extends the value of your flow license, allowing users to select only the products they need. Today's workforce demands great flexibility and working from home can add some performance challenges. Now when users use the borrow license function with network licenses, they have the option to use only the licenses that are borrowed and block the client's communication with the server. This results in faster load times for SOLIDWORKS. With more and more users transitioning to the 3D Experience platform, there is a need to share and collaborate with others who are not on the platform. This is done through the 3D Experience Exchange add-in. In 2023, this add-in installs by default and allows users outside the platform to receive a package of content from the 3D Experience source. They can add to and modify the content and then send it back to the 3D Experience source. This data protects your IP and maintains the data in your system while easily collaborating with others outside of the 3D Experience platform. SOLIDWORKS 2023 continues to make managing and accessing your licenses easier. Be sure to check out these great new enhancements.